You're probably not overjoyed by your parking charge notice from NSL and the immediate question is, should you pay or appeal? If you think you've been served this ticket unfairly, then you should definitely appeal. I'll move on to my top five ways to appeal your NSL ticket in a minute. But first, it's important to understand that private parking tickets are more like an invoice than a fine. The reason that you've been landed with one is because the operator believes that you haven't abided by the rules that should be clearly signposted when you drive in. The moment that you drive into an NSL car park, they're watching you like a hawk to make sure that you follow their parking procedures. But sometimes they get it wrong. AMPR cameras have been known to read registrations incorrectly. Also, thanks to new legislation, there's more leniency and room for human error on the driver's part, on our part, so you have more reasons to appeal than you thought. If you choose to appeal, then you've got 28 days from receiving the ticket to do so, which puts any further actions on hold and you can appeal in three different ways you can do it by email by post or online evidence is crucial so get as much as you possibly can i'll tell you why it's best not to ignore your parking fine after my five great reasons to appeal your nsl ticket number one you were within the grace period so you're entitled to 10 minutes after your ticket expires to get back to your car so if you were like only a couple of minutes after your allotted time then you've got a really strong case to appeal number two the signs weren't very clear so for example they could be faded hidden by trees broken or barely visible you'll need photo evidence to back this up so take as many as you can and a video if possible number three you're unable to get back to your vehicle now this could be a medical emergency or something just as serious Again, you'll need to be able to prove it. Number four, you couldn't get back in time because you've got mobility issues. If you're disabled, pregnant, or you've got a very young baby, the Equality Act says that you must be treated with understanding. And number five, you were parked correctly and an error was made. It happens. You've probably already got the hint by now, but the more you can prove, the better. It gives your appeal against NSL a better chance. Ignoring the parking ticket isn't advised. And I do get asked a lot if these private firms can can enforce the fines on private property. Technically, they can't demand payment, only a court can. But if NSN wins against you in a civil court, both your pockets and credit history could be affected. Ignoring the fine might lead to legal consequences. And whilst it's not a certainty, there is a risk that you could be taken to court. Before it gets to that, you could be sent demand letters and potentially be contacted by debt collection agencies. And if the operator decides to take legal action and wins, it could result in a negative mark on your credit score. A CCJ, that's a county court judgment, would affect your credit rating for six years, which makes it harder to get credit and lower interest rates. Ultimately, the decision to pay or appeal an NSL fine rests on the evidence that that ticket might be unjust. If there's clear proof of violations by the operator, then an appeal's definitely worth a go. However, if the fault clearly lies with you, especially for minor infringements, then it might be wiser to pay up, ideally within that first couple of weeks to get the discounted rate. Should your appeal get rejected, there's another recourse. The independent appeal services, that's Poplar, could be your next step but you need the official letter of rejection before proceeding. If you're still undecided about whether to appeal and you want to speak to a professional, then you might want to have a chat with online solicitors Just Answer. They're running a £5 trial and you can ask them as many questions as you need in the online chat to help you make your mind up. I'll leave a link to them below this video for you. Best of luck.